see. Yeah, the pastor tells us that at least nine cars were broken into. Thieves took whatever they could grab, all while this was happening behind the church where the wedding was going on. Oh my goodness, that's terrible. It's a church and a wedding, it's, that's, that's evil. It's an evil that happened at St. Anthony of Padua Church on Canal Street. There was a wedding uh, Saturday night that started about six o'clock. The wedding got out about 7.30 and they came out here and found nine cars broken into. Now that's surprising, they do it while the wedding's going on thinking no one's gonna come out and catch them. That's pretty bold. What did you see when you first came out? Well, we would see windows of cars knocked out, a lot of glass on the ground. Uh, we would see sometimes things gone through in cars. The pastor says the thieves took phones, wedding gifts, and at least $1,500 in cash. You don't have a wedding and expect your car to be broken into, let alone on church property. Fortunately, of all things, the couple had gotten into the limousine out front and went to their uh, venue. Their hopeful police have enough evidence to find who's responsible. Meanwhile, they're increasing security. We, the church, are planning on hiring uh, security people for weddings and other evening events that happen. And you don't want anybody to be a victim for anything, but it's, it's difficult, we're not exempt. Now the church actually installed LED lights and more security cameras after a break-in at the church eight months ago. It's not clear if those security cameras caught this set of break-ins. And right now police say they have no suspects in the case. Reporting live in Mid-City, I'm Casey Ferran, WDSU News.